no one does science alone. As good as you are on your own, you will be better when you find a few people with complementary skills. Out of all of my relatives on both sides, paternal and maternal, um, everyone's an engineer. We have one dentist, we don't know where he came from, but everybody's an engineer. Different disciplines, my father's petroleum, I've got uh, uh, one uncle who's electrical, I've got another one who is uh, mechanical, my sister's computer engineering. So when you started looking at all these different engineers throughout the family, it, it was just, it was almost like what you did. I work with uh, hydrogen and natural gas storage for vehicle applications. I'm also working on a project with uh, natural gas separations. And in all those, the common denominator is we're trying to figure out how to store or uh, utilize new storage methods in order to get the most gas in a small, confined space. Having to budget your time properly, that's usually the hardest part. Early in my career, I made a lot of mistakes because I would spend hours trying to solve this issue, not realizing I could walk down the hall and knock on somebody's door who's been working on that type of problem for 10, 20 years, and I could have gotten a solution in a matter of minutes, as opposed to wasting a day or even a week at times on some of these things. So you need to call on those people to help is crucial to really growing yourself and to getting the most done and getting the best results. Expanding in natural gas is a natural fit for the Savannah River National Laboratory. We are the gas handling experts when it comes to the Department of Energy complex. There's all kinds of great things that can come from us expanding into those areas. And I think the private sector actually appreciates it when we start looking in an area where they find some use, because that means that the tax dollars coming out of that industry are now being used for something that can help the industry. Here at the National Lab, everything we do is open. When we work on things, we come up with these new technologies, we want the public to know about it. We want the industry to know about it. We want people to see the great things that we're working on. Uh, from a professional standpoint, what I'm most proud of, uh, I'm really proud to be involved with a lot of the researchers that I get to work with on a daily basis here at the site and in some of our outside partners because we're really working with some very large names in uh, scientific and application uh, areas and I'm very proud to be working with them, and I'm very proud that they you know, count me as one of their peers. If I'm driving down the road uh, you know, a few years from now and I see someone who's, got, who's driving, you know, say, a Ford vehicle that's got the CNG logo on the back of it, and I realize that that's my tank. I helped design that. I helped design that storage system. I helped design the energy transfer system. I helped that. So I think that'll be a much greater reward than uh, almost anything that I could do.